a dream I know Deep up my feelings feel Hello reality viewers, welcome back again to Reality Latest Gist, the home of news and politics. For this channel, we they drop news every day and we they react to every video when it comes our way. And our reality news now we they drop for this channel and we they also they talk come as it be. If today not the first time we say they come across this channel, you are highly welcome. Thank you so much for stopping by. And if you are returning subscribers, I appreciate all of you now for our massive support to this channel i say may god bless all of you now in jesus name amen i get video away i want to present to una this very moment and i'm going to follow now they watch the video after we don't watch them together make we drop our opinion constructively for the comment session like our videos and also share our video dss don't arrest the lome liar with three other people because of say he talk shoot for a father's land anyway go now watch the video particularly concerned and call on the state security services and the Nigeria police force to immediately restrain persons such as Melaye, Momodu, and a certain pastor, Paul Enenche of Dunamis Church. They should be restrained from their clear call to violence. Melaye streets threatening violence, Momodu going on TV to announce the purported winner, and a nature's hate speech from the pulpit clearly violates every law of the land. They should not go scot-free. When failure stare them in the face, rather than accepting the outcome with dignity like good Democrats would, some sore losers began shopping for ways to cut corners or scuttle the process. We have seen so many doctored results giving false victory to the Labour Party in places where it performed and dismally poor. Shebi, I talk and say, don't they start small, small. They don't order arrest of Ebele Momodu, Dino Melai, and Paul Eneche, Pastor Paul Eneche, because of this speech, what I will show you now, because of waiting they talk, APC don't order for the arrest immediately that DSS should look for them. What a country. What be say, if you talk the right thing, they will arrest you. Just watch this video so I go show. Okay, watch the no Melai own now. Watch the no Melai speech. We make them say may they arrest him because he's standing on his right. Watch him. Share this video as you they watch. They share him. Share this video. Let everything be on internet. Share him. Those of us who spoke from this angle are representatives of the political parties that participated in this election, and it is only responsible for INEC to listen to us. When you made your presentation earlier, you made it look as if agents are just here to rubber stamp whatever the um, returning officers are presenting. Because you said you passed that stage, it's at the stage of um, world pulling units. But the provisions of section 65 have already mandated you because you are also a returning officer in this election it's just the difference is that they are returning officers from the states and you are returning results for the presidential election and the provision of section 65 is very very unambiguous and is clear and it is that you have the power and capacity to review results here and you cannot review results if there are no agitation of infractions from the political parties and that is what we are saying that we cannot move forward except the law is respected except the promise you made to nigerians i have just done a little research you have promised nigeria 68 times that beavers will work and my brother, Barista Francis Okoye, after I checked using Google Machine, I promised Nigeria 118 times that beavers will work. We want to see it work and working by going to the portal to see all these results. It worked in Edo, it worked in Osho, it must work in this presidential election. We cannot proceed 
with or collation of results when we don't we cannot see the confidence we have in this electoral act is the introduction of the electronic transmission of results if that is not done then there is no difference between what we are doing now and what we did in 2015 because what you are doing is practical manual collation that means the billions of taxpayers money including mine that was spent on the issue of beavers and transmission of electronic results is wasted and we should not be wasters we want a categorical response on this issue of uploading results thank you i next field in this regard and when this issue was when i raised this issue today supported by other party agents the national chairman of INEC evaded um vehemently evaded that because what section 47 3 emphasizes that wherever uh, the the card reader or the beavers fail if they cannot get a replacement election should be cancelled in those areas and we have seen for the presentation of the um, results from um, yesterday that some places were cancelled as a result of bypassing uh, beavers. So the only way to detect that beavers have been bypassed is for us to see the uploaded results. And we insisted that the chairman should show us here now the uploaded results state by state, just like the way they are displaying the collated results they are presenting. And that is the only way to test the veracity and authenticity of these results. If not, so you see, it is see. It is see the model because of St. John's Praise Labour Party performance in Lagos. So just that. The order for his arrest, immediate arrest. Is this the government we are going? Hey, we are finished. APC has managed to control the Southwest. But they've been fatally wounded in Lagos by the Labour Party. Fatally wounded because they needed to win a huge margin in Lagos that is now impossible they have also been injured in Kano by NNP, NNPP we are finished completely finished so this is the new government that is coming now watch waiting prophet Paul Enete talk Pastor Paul Enete talk he cause people he no mention any name Paul Enete cause people he no mention any name how you take notes and are you then they talk about if you know they do the things when talk say you they do no if you know they do the evil things when they rebook why you go say me they arrest her he did not mention any name why how do apc know that he's talking about them if they are not doing what he said they are doing watch the video now sorry the video is a bit long watch them as you they watch they share them they share this video share this video make the world watch make the world see before they arrest them Let's see if they deserve to be arrested. A word of caution. Dear friends, we have witnessed an unusually stressful and challenging elections and vote casting process under very difficult conditions in most cases. Yesterday, some people's voting didn't start till around 1 p.m. Some people in some places had rains and all manner of things, all manner of strenuous conditions. But I saw patriotism enthusiasm and the determination of our nation's citizens for a change of story like I have never before seen record breaking turnout crowds our polling unit maybe the crowd multiply like 10 times of what it has ever been with multitudes of first time voters unfortunately the human demons in our country and their lunatic mad agents in various parts of this country didn't allow for a peaceful and just process in those places. Video recordings of their misdeeds were flying from Lagos, from Rivers, from Kogi, from Anambra, etc. with thugs at the helm of affairs at certain units. Someone was saying, if you are not voting our party, in a particular polling unit in Lagos and the police was standing right there live here what a country I thought I had an order that every talk should be shut down at sight there was a place where the gate was locked 
and the thugs told the people if you do if you are not voting our party they are party they are disastrous nonsense useless party don't come in here in some places people are told if you don't want to vote our party go back to your place in certain places there was a report report of no more presidential ballot papers but there were ballot papers for senatorial and house of reps there were other places where a particular party's logo and name was not on the ballot paper at all also there were cases of thugs snatching ballot papers on the age voting I think they showed me a clip of a boy of about is it four years or five years six years casting a vote somewhere the question is who are the kinds of leaders or aspirants who will orchestrate those kinds of criminality they are worthless valueless generational liabilities mobile disasters who have neither the credibility relevance or quality to command any form of followership or win any form of credible election so they have to resort to criminality thuggery and all forms of manipulated devices to attempt to win the lord rebuke you those are prim primordial medieval outmoded antiquated outdated primitive obsolescent entities ancient people who belong only to history and not to the modern times bringing stone age barbaric savage bestial animal behavior into contemporary times using power snatching and voter intimidation when you look at them they look like animals both those dogs and those who send them like animals what monkeys will not do what baboons will not do are what these human demons in the name of so-called aspiration aspiring leaders animals trying to lead the human human beings impossible animals trying to lead people animals apes trying to lead human beings it is impossible we announced that they are at the end of their road politically and otherwise since they have confirmed that they don't belong to this age who are these kinds of leaders they are detestable abhorrent reprehensible obnoxious odious personalities bent on immersing the nation in the flavor of shame and ignominy in the eyes of the international community as they watch all the terrible things through their contemptible and secreted abominable electoral crimes and actions bringing Nigeria into odium and opprobrium we announced that the shame that they are bringing trying to bring on the nation remains their shame forever it remains the shame of all that pertains to them forever voting manipulation all manner of things now despite all these abnormalities cited the people of Nigeria overwhelmingly expressed their choice of leadership through their vote everywhere everywhere voting against even so-called aspirants and winning them in their own grounds in their polling units winning them in their territories in their so-called states the people spoke through their vote this is my counsel to INEC INEC be strongly advised to do the right thing and do it on time issues of inability to uphold upload results on server failure of resource upload from beavers machines delaying the arrival of results especially from the northern parts of this country is raising cause suspicion they are raising a lot of suspicion what was the use of giving the hope to the country i make it ready beavers machine automatic transmission of results and yet we are here still here now result manipulation and all manner of things are still going on kindly ensure that this is not game as usual every attempt at scuttling the will of the people or frustrating the zeal of the youth will only produce unimaginable consequences you are not dealing with 
dummies. You are dealing with intelligent people. Nigerians are tired of the games of these demonic agents. And we are not going to take it anymore. People have voted. They are watching their votes. People already have the results of their polling units. Etc. As confirmed at the end of the voting exercise. Just be wise. Do the right thing. And go down in history. In honor. I'm talking to the ILEC leadership right now. The chairman. Do the right thing. And go down in history. In honor and dignity. Or do the wrong thing. And go down in shame. And ignominy and infamy. Forever. God bless Nigeria. Stand up for your feet people. We are not. We are not. Hear me. We are not going to take. We are not going to take rubbish from anybody. We are not going to take garbage from anybody. You can't take anybody for the ride. You have taken us for the ride for too long. And now we won't take rubbish. Lift up your hands. The Bible said there are many devices in the heart of man. 200 million people taken for a ride by a few, a few, a few irresponsible, redundant, remotely disconnected human entities that don't belong to this present age. Few of them, handful of them. Valuable for nothing. They are sellable for nothing. They are not marketable. Taking a whole nation for a ride. You are, you are, you are joking. You haven't, you are joking. Lift up your hands. The Bible said in the book of Job chapter 5 verse 12. There are many devices in the heart of a man. Nevertheless, the counsel of the Lord that shall stand. Lift your hands and say after me, say, Father, Father we, ask we ask that your counsel, that your counsel in, Nigeria in Nigeria shall stand. Shall stand. Your, counsel your counsel in Nigeria, in Nigeria shall, stand. shall stand. Your counsel, your counsel in, Nigeria in Nigeria shall stand. Shall stand. Say, Father, Father we, ask we ask that you frustrate, that you frustrate the, counsel the counsel of the devil. Of the devil. They, are they have not even won no. Now they have started for arrest of everybody. If you talk, they arrest you. Hey, military rule is even better. Army, come and take the country back. We can't manage democracy. Come and take this country back. We can't manage democracy. Army people, come. We are beg, oh, come. We can't oh, arrest up and down. Another Osa Abiola is coming. What happened during that Abiola time is going to happen now because just imagine if the state has started their own protest that they did not vote for APC. But that court, River State have started their own protest that they did not vote for APC. It's not yet over. <laughs> Don't celebrate anywhere you are. If you are APC, just relax first. Share this video. Share this video. Share this video. Share them. Let others see what is going on, what is happening in Nigeria. People outside this country, make us see what's in the happen. Share this video. We are finished.